Hey your friends, welcome back to another video. Um gonna go straight into it. Um the last session was really good. Um gonna go from here. Um wish me luck guys. Alright, gonna set it up. Hopefully everyone's doing well. Good go for steel. Holding A6 officer. I should get a three but ace king. Gonna go for steel six four officer. 10-7 for a steal. Just gonna check 6-4 <clears throat> with a pair. Just gonna continue there. Okay, we've got a we've got a gut shot with uh, 6-4. Okay, we can just check there. We've got a decent hand, I think. Gut shot with 10-9, but we could have reverse implied odds. Meaning if we do get our cards, it might not be great. Yeah, it's folding, folding, folding. A couple of folds, King Nine folding. A couple of hands there. We probably could have tried betting there with um with 10 9, just the fact that none was showing strength. So it should randomly show some probably show a little bit of a bet there. Six four we actually won the hand. Won a few little pots there as well. That's nice. I think everyone folded to us with that uh, ace king, so that was good. Got a bet there with jacks. I'm gonna fold with a6 officer just because made a position there. Betting with jacks again. Doesn't have an ace, he's just gonna fold, and that's probably best case scenario. Because we did three bet and there was some dead um there's some get dead um money as well, so it sort of helps. Ace for offsuit. It's not a great hand, but could I open? Alright, three betting ace coin offsuit. Queen eight folding. Normally I do open. I'm gonna fold ace coin offsuit just because it's under the gun and I'm not that deep. It seems pretty tight. We could have called and then Probably would have had to put it with a C bet. Sometimes you hit a queen, you're still not good. All right, ace forward, we're opening. I uh, got a flatten with uh, ace suited. I uh, got a flat there with ace four suited. Uh, off suit. Ace eight gonna fold. It doesn't seem to be a good block for us there. Queen nine's gone. It's gonna call a king four suited. Aces we decided to bet there. I got a half bet there. He seems quite weak. Our ace could actually be good there. Gonna try and steal with 10 3 offsuit. No. Nah. Um, so you went all in with queens, it looks like. Ah, oh, queen 10, even worse. So that's a nice catch for us. I accidentally called that one. No, I'm just gonna fold 10 2. I'm going to check there behind. I don't like the hand though. Go three bet nines. Uh, I'm going to bet there with seven six. I think we can't win the showdown, so we're just going to try and steal it. King four is gone. A seven's gone. Hit a four, we're going to go try and go to showdown. All right, so we've hit a four, we'll get a call. Hit quads, we're just going to check it. It's gonna hope uh, someone bets into us. I'm gonna call with sixes. We made the showdown with six four. That was the goal. Jack, Jack six is gone. All right, flooding with sixes. He's betting into us, so we're just gonna flat there. He's falling into our trap. I'm gonna flat uh, queens there. Sixes, I'm going to call one more time, just in case he's got a jack. We could get a six and get a lot of money from him. Queens, we're going to check. All right, it's going to shop him all in on the river. We've got quads. He can call if he doesn't call. It doesn't matter what he does. All right, I can call with a couple of 20 cents with queens. Could still spike a queen there. 
Also, now there's two kings on there, we could have a better hand. He could just have ace jack or something like that, and he's whiffed it. I'm going to call because it's just a weak bet. I'm going to call another nine. Could even check raise there. It's going to check behind. If he raises again, we're going to fold. Alright. Uh, I'm just going to call behind, actually. I'm not really happy with it. I'm going to call him anyway. We've gone that far. I think folding there is robbing us. Alright, hit troops with aces. Let's get a call there, just to encourage him to steal. Alright, so he won the hand, but it was only a small pot. Gotta bet aces and um, troops there. Uh, it's gonna check behind there, hopefully get a heart on the river. Hit a jack. I think we can't bet it. I'm just gonna call there. Behind. Uh, just check behind. The last thing you can do is, you know, you bet there and you get put off your hand. Uh, I'm gonna call with jacks. Uh, hit top pair. It's gonna check behind. We could probably bet that flop. Um, we could probably bet the turn only for the fact that we could have a better hand. Got a call behind there with. I think it's Titan. Um, yeah, could call again. Let's check behind. We could have a lot of worse hands in his range. Sixes are going to let go. We could have probably called. There's two other people in the hand, so. Let's just keep an eye out. Um, we've got 27 behind us, just so we get an idea when we finish up how much we got left. But Alright, gonna call pocket fires, but we are in a position. We could argue about raising. Fives are just checking behind. Ace five's nice. Just go for the steal. Going for the steal again. Probably could have opened with King 10 offsuit. Uh just gonna drop Ace uh, five, sorry. Ace eight's gone. King four is gone. Didn't work with the steal, that's fine. Not every steal has to work for it to be successful. We could have probably bet there. Alright, Ace Jack suited. Queen Nine suited is nice. Alright, I got a three bet with Ace Jack off suit. I right, gotta bet this one. A lot of kings are in our range. I'm just gonna flat Ace suited type hands. Just gonna check there behind, hopefully get a queen. Alright, no luck there, unfortunately. I'm going to fold ace-10 suited as much as I don't want to. Yep, king's just going to bet. Spock a queen on the river. Oh, we can actually bet there for thin value. Hopefully a jack calls. If he's got a flush, he's going to tell us anyway. He's going to raise us. If not, he's just going to call behind. Uh, safe board for queens is, uh, for kings. We're just going to keep betting there. And I think we're just going to keep going for value with kings at this stage. There's no reason for us to slow down. Queen seven's gone. All right, gone. Uh, we'll go for the steal. That's going to fight King Jack suited. We could probably raise it there if we really wanted to. All right, a couple of hands there. Got an open end. We're just going to check it. You could possibly check raise, but I want to see the whole equity. Good news, bad news is we hit a set, but we need the board to pair up. Hit top pair with King Jack. We got to check, check there. King Queen. We got to check there as well. Five three. We didn't get there at all, but that's fine. I'm gonna bet the two because it seems to be a safe board there. Yeah, I think we just call. He could have aces, and yeah, we were good there. He had pocket tens. So just a sticky pocket tens. It's hard to be scared of anything there. He bets into us. We're going to fold there because of spades. Well, I think it was clubs, actually. There's too many uh, 
All right, top two pair we're betting. I got a bet there as well. Got two pair. King Jack with his. We got a bet there as well. Uh, five four. We can bet that one. Just because there's nothing in the pot already, so we can just bet it. Going for the steal. Uh, Jack's a four betting there. There is a chance that he'll real repop us, like shove him after that, and then we'll just get out of the way. If he doesn't, means he's got like a nice king, maybe or a queens, or some people actually do it with the kings. All right, so we started off right. We got a bit there with the club. We have got king of clubs. The only thing we're worried about is the ace. We're just going to keep going for Vega, get a flat ace eight suitor, which is nice. I think we just continue betting here. I think there's no reason to show, um, to slow down. I just got a call. If he's got the ace over here, I don't think we're that worried. Okay, it was a cool R. Which means, um, you must have had the, must have had the ace. Missed by hands. All right, gonna. I got a flush draw there, but drawing to the nuts. We actually missed. That's unfortunate. King queen. I probably could have called the king actually, just because the king was the spade. Ace King, Ace Queen were actually just calling behind. There is diamonds down, it's gonna fold. Don't wanna chase a straight when the, the flush is already there. I don't want reverse reply dots. Turn nine's not a great board. Alright, 10 nine at the moment. I got a three bet ace queen. Could have opened to be nine seven. Going for the steal with the small blinds, that's fine. The green tables we could go for a lot more stealing. Point seven's gonna fly out. Pocket nine's gonna open. Queen jack gonna fold. Especially against under the gun range. I didn't actually realize, but the under the gun is called, um, it's actually called the low, the low jack, but that's in, that's in a nine ring game and it's not actually under the gun. All right. Got an open ender with pocket sevens. Probably could even bet there. Just to get value from the river bets when we hit our card. Ace nine offsuit, got a bet. Sevens is checking there. Ace King Officer opening up. Could throw bet Ace 8, but we're tightening up, so we fold.
I can check the open. Bit of straight there, which is nice. The noise in the background, so we're just muting the microphone a little bit sometimes. Okay, we get a raise here. He's drawing to us. Um, we're gonna go all in on the return as well. I will call him now, and that's fine. He had trip twos. Uh, we ended up straighting it, so that was a nice hand, nice catch for us. So if you had a straight, he would have uh, caught us, but he, uh, if he had a, if he was blushing, he would have caught us, but no, that's fine. Right, cut short. <laughs> Queen 10. Uh, I'm gonna fold there because you could have 10. All right, Queen 10, I don't, not happy with it, but against Ace King, we got two active cards. All right, Queen 10, gonna fold. All right, let him get over there. Just gonna check behind with the king queen. I right, got a flat ace jack. Check three, get a bet. All right, just call behind. Uh, check behind again. If he checks again to us, we get a bet. The ace jack. All right, hit the king. Let's get out the way, that's fine. He's got lucky, you gotta check there, King Queen. We've got a lot of outs. Check three is now gone, probably shouldn't have opened. Ace Queen, he just goes into our nuts, that's good, we go for that. So we're going extremely well. I'm gonna follow his Queen there, just because of the fact that uh, we did have a lot of, um, what do you call it? Uh, there's a lot of uh, flush draws out there. Could have had reverse implied odds as well. Six four is gone. Got a flat ace resuited. King five gonna let go. Man, that ace jack hand in position. We could have probably bet the turn. All right, got king queen. Ace jack here. I'm going to bet it and then just see. I'm just going to try and bluff him on the river. All right. That's fine. He just wanted to play back. That's all right. We're giving him a reason to play back at us. So he might drop his guard down when we do have a hand. A6 suited. We're going to call. 10 threes out of the way. A3 is gone. Let's make sure. We just going to check behind here. Check behind there as well. Let's get a call there. We don't need to raise. I've got a good hand with a6. 8 6 is gone. Ah, just check behind. Could have the ace that wins the game. Alright, pocket two is entering the pot. I'm going to call here because of the four, but can't be that excited about it. Jack six is going to open up. Pretty much, I'm going to fight king four suited, especially in position. Actually, we can raise here. We actually got the straight. King nine gonna fold. Pretty much gonna fold pretty tightly across the board, unless we're in the dealer button. Might be still open up a little bit from the cutoff, but we're not gonna be insane. King four is just a bluff catcher. Queen eight, we're just gonna call behind. There's no point three betting if they're just gonna call you, because the chances of making the hands pretty slim. So just keep the money down as low as you can and then get the show down if you can. 
and that way you get um it's you recognize the equity you got all right we had top pair before but we just call behind just to try and get we're just trying to get to oh actually i'm fold here i'm gonna fold that top pair it's a lot of um straights out there already sevens aren't looking good because the flush draws there all right got ace two gonna open up just gonna check there all right gotta bet the flush on the river we might call a small raise i'm not sure yet all right seven six in position i'm gonna call seven three just gonna check there and 34 so it's in the pot we're gonna fight for that all right gonna check behind got top pair chances of him on the king is not that great Got mid pair with sevens. Yeah, just gonna check behind there. If he bets us, we can call a small bet as well. All right, got pocket kings, nice. Let's go check behind. All right, nine five of folding. Could have call with pocket twos. Could have continue betting with kings. All right, ace five, no point calling. I'm actually gonna bet there on bluff. Open ender with seven six continue the betting going on with the kings 19's you're going to uh pocket two's going to flat just continue betting there's no reason why not we can't you could just have anything at this stage you could have called one more with twos all right just continue betting here there's a lot of uh, draws that can make the river uh, it's going to fold twos there if we hit our two, we're getting stacks in, which would have been fine as well. Seven six suit is fine. All right, checking there, it's no point. Ace five will open up. Ace king will open up. Ace two, no, no. All right, getting rid of some of these traps. Let's get rid of some of these trappy hands. I right, got a four bet ace king suited. Got a flat ace five. Big bucks, Benny. Unfortunately, he's gonna make the play and just uh, make money from us from preflop. It's gonna bet there with Ace King suited. It's not a great flop. Just wanting to, we just want him to fold. Mm -hmm. uh, betting there with uh, Jax, just hoping he didn't have an ace. Fighting King Queen. Are we hit top pair? Seven six will be the opening up. I gotta bet there are king queen. Sometimes just checking behind us to save money's fine as well. Alright, jacks are going. I gotta call behind here. He's not a doesn't look like a good player. Top pair, okay, kick up. I got a flush draw. Maybe a gut shot as well. All right, we're gonna bet that one. We got a straight. Ace five, got two pair. Check 10, get open. Some four's gone. Let's get a check there, ace 10. If, he, if he's got no spade, good on him. If he's bluffing that, check 10, just get a call. It's not a great hand, but a lot of hands he whiffs here that we can, he might slow down on the flop and we just steal from him. All right, just folding there, it's fine. But we could have made a lot of hands where, you know, we, post flop, we could easily get him. Okay, he's probably cool because he got a lot of backdoor flush draws coming through. Alright, no help there, we just let that one go. Let ace five go. King eight will open. Yeah, king eight offsuit, we're just folding there. Could be argue the point of um, four bidding there, but I don't think so. It's just because we blocked some of these high cards, but that's probably for a higher a higher rating. Uh, we've hit a three, so we'll call. Pop fours, pop fives, let's go. Okay, so he checked us. That's huge. Our three could actually be good here. All right, got a call there. Got top pair, which is nice. Let's get the board low. Get a call behind. We've got a book. 
and just check behind the three. It's either good or not. All right, kings are betting there. Fives are betting there. Let's get a check behind with fours. Make him actually beat us. Like right, post flop, king jack suited. We're betting in. All right, I'm gonna bet the suited. Could actually have a worse. Um, oh, that's actually a really nice card for us. Uh, we'll probably call any raise as well if he shoves all in. All right, that's not a good card. We're just gonna check behind here. All right, King Jack's just checking behind to get to the river. It's a nasty bet, actually. I'm gonna fold. Ace King, we whiffed it. Seven five, we're just avoiding the limper. Ace King's whiff, so we just let go. King Jack with betting in, like raising the limper with King Jack, opening up with seven five suited. Now right, hit top pair, good kicker, we just check it. Got a lot of draws now, so we pull a uh, turn card, which is fine. All right, we just get to the river and check there, it's fine. Four two actually got the worst flop ever. There's not going to be good, too many good flops for four two, so. That's why you not really get excited about that hand. Six for offsets going. We're going to call one more for fours. Just the fact that if we spuck a four on the river, it could be a an easy raise on the river. Fours is gone. Um, four two, we're going to bet there just because he can't win showdown. So you never know. There's been a, it's a low pot. He didn't really show any strength, so he could just fold. 6 4 suited. Right, top pair, top kicker, we'll get a better. Alright, 6 4 suited is going in the trash. Right, we'll throw a bet in, see what happens. A3 is gone. Queen 10 opening up. Ace Queen opening up. King 2 opening up. And six suitors going. Queen two just gonna call behind. <laughs> it's into offset. Oh, I got a flat there. Not a bad hand for queen. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna call uh, Ace Queen actually. Queen two's gone. Just gonna try and catch up on some of these hands. Just gonna flat some of these. Gonna raise Queen ten suited. A C bet there with Ace Queen, I think that's fine. A fold with uh, King Two, because at worst we could be uh, really behind. We've got Nine's got a raise. All right, Ace Queen failed. Yeah, Ace Queen failed. We we'll just let it go. Good call, Pocket Nines. Open up with 8-7 suited. Uh, nines is gone. What well, kings are going in? Uh, it's going for a steal. I uh, just gonna check there with it. The, but the turn could be a club though, so it could be a terrible decision. Board needs to pair up and then we shove the river. We cannot be happy unless the board pairs up. Uh, we just got to call behind. We've got a bluff catcher. So we didn't pump the... We didn't pump the, uh, the pot too much. So calling the river is fine. Need a nine. Queen Jack's not going to win. Pocket sevens. King Queen, you get a bet in. Tens are in. Alright, flatting there with King Nine suited. I could have flat with Ace King. We have a position. We don't need to beef up the pot too much. We're only gonna hit the 
the flop any, you know, one out of three times. Let's check that we just set with tens. I could have bet there with the. Probably could have even checked raise there. Ace King just gonna fold, get out of the way. We lost the minimum with Ace King. I was bleeding a lot of points with those type of hands. And you can see how the pots are quite considerably lower now. Probably 10 9 students a bit wide. Suited top hands, you'll notice that I'm more willing to call. I think I got a double gutter there, so that's fine. 10 9, we hit a pair. Uh, yeah, pocket tens. 8 7 gonna open, but it just. Those type of hands everyone goes nuts on, like this. We're not even deep stacks, so I'm just gonna let it go, unfortunately. If we've got an ace or something, you could probably just shove over the top, like a strong ace. Those players are so, I don't know, they seem to be pretty wide. 10 2 is gonna call behind and just see what we can get. See if we can um, overestimate something if we hit something really well. All right, I say offsuit, it's fine. Some coins going on with pop fives. Yeah, got a three bet pocket tens. We could have just called behind as well. Yeah, it's called pop of fives. We don't need to do anything crazy. Maybe four is gone. All right, got an open ender now with pocket fives, which is nice. Hit our straight, we got a better. It's going to call 9-7 suited. Hopefully you don't get squeezed on. As long as people don't 3-bet uh, and you just call behind, then you're not getting punished for calling. And then you actually benefit just from flat calling. It keeps the pot low. It's only when you get 3-betted uh, and 4-betted a lot when you call behind. It's when it starts hurting you. Right, we hit a 7. Could just be the best hand there that need to... Do anything too crazy. Get the river to most of our marginal hands. Uh, King Queen just whiffed it. We're not going to stay in the hand. Hit a four. Don't think it's going to last, but it would be good against like uh, overcards. Because I think it was a low flop, uh, a low board. I just going to call there seven six suited. I'm going to get a check raise with 7-6, I believe. Ace four is gone. I'm going to check raise there. There's an ace on the board. Eight, 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 uh, ace, jack's gone. 6-5 or flat. Uh, I'm just going to bet our trips there. We could have the worst hand now because there's a flush out there. Uh, we'll call the 5. We could probably bet there and he might fold a queen. But people don't fold enough. We call sevens. Pause with this coin again. Ace two will open up. Jack Queen Jack will open up. And just gonna call one more. Ace is going to 3 bet. Call behind with 10 8. Goes all in. Lucky we didn't bet there. Tens, we could probably check raise. I'm going to call one more. Actually, no. I'm just. Yeah, actually, going to call one more and see what happens. King 3 could have flat, but we decided not to. Uh, I'm going to call 16 more cents. It's only 16. Need a king or a nine, so we'll call one more. Just need a spade and we'll win the game, but who knows? Probably could have bet the river there. I don't think he's calling with a nine, uh, with a ten. 
Yeah, nine aces. Missed it. Yeah, a bit of folding going on. Eights could be good there. Right, kings are good to go. To compare with ace queen. Alright, sevens will fold and we'll just check behind with the eights. Alright, got aces. Looks like our kings got folded too. Alright, let's check behind. We could possibly go for thin value there, but you could have a weak king though. Alright, let's get a check there. Or we'll just call it ace five. Looks like there's an ante there. I uh, could probably check race the six two suited. Just because there's not much showdown value. There's a big difference. Yeah, so we'll check raise there. Is six two just the fact that he will fold a lot of hands? Anywhere that we got showdown value, we'll. Sl it wasn't five two. Five two didn't show anything. We're gonna call one with pocket queens. We do have a heart with nines. Is it gonna be good though? Right, ace queen's gone. We missed it. Uh, it's going to fold there with nines. No telling if uh, the heart's any good. But the way he's betting, it looks like it might be. It was like he really didn't want to call. Light opens there. Ah, I missed the steal actually. I'm gonna call one, see if it's like a nine. All right, so hit a pair plus. Oh, same thing again. Probably could have called the nine. All right, I can raise there. Got a straight. Yep, he's only got nine. I don't know what he had here. Trash. Missed everything with ace three, unfortunately. Queen two missed as well. That's fine. We stopped betting anyway. Nine eight suited. We're just checking behind to see if we can get to uh, see a diamond. Nine eight, we'll just call. Nine eight, we got an open ender. Got an open ender for nine eight as well. Seven three, just gonna check behind. Uh, it's not the one I wanted. Looking to fold there. I'm right, gonna call seven three just because the straight draws. Same as that. Open ender still. It's gonna fold there. Seven three didn't make it, unfortunately. How we're looking? Still at twenty, which is good. I think King Queen. We probably should, could have raised there actually. Ace Queen suited. We're just gonna check behind. Just the fact that. Uh, you know, a lot of, if there's clubs on the board, we actually get all these trash uh, clubs to come in and follow. And, you know, if he makes a flush, he's got to raise and re-raise. And we get out for cheap otherwise. Right, so, we could, I feel like we're continuing on the good form from last session. Uh, we can go for a 10, but there's an ace or a queen there, so there's a lot of books. 
Little full houses, so we're not chasing a straight. Letting this go. Alright, so now that we've improved our play a little bit more, uh, but we'll move up to 5NL very soon. And we'll probably continue this type of play for the next level, probably until 10NL, and then what you're seeing previous that wasn't working at 2NL, we'll probably have to start playing it if we make it to like 20NL or 25NL. All right, we're just going to call behind here. We could have fall better there, but... All right, just going to call with eights. It's not the best card to see. Now, doing a lot of calling. I've got a bet there. Eights are just going to check through. Gonna check one. Oh, I'm going to call one more with the uh, eight of diamonds as well. King tens folded. Oh, with the kings, we can. We can probably call these river bets now if they're small enough. If he does a handsome size, we can just check it behind here. It's fine. A lot of times he'll have a he'll have a queen and he just wants us to bet, and then they'll just shove us on the river. This way we keep the pot low against his dangerous hands. Check right. We're gonna check. Try and check raise here. The set of twos. Now I got a raise there. Looks like we can be drawing some of the time. I got a flat check tens. It's a bit of dead, um, dead coin in the background. All right, I got a flush draw now, which is nice. So we'll make another call. Five four is definitely getting some help. Jack ten got some help. Jack four missed the building. Uh, we're just going to bet our uh, misdraw there. By four still could get some help. Yeah, it's going to shove him. By four is gone. Yeah, it's cash out. He's got pocket jacks in when I let go, so that was a nice shove. Can't always be scared of better hands. All right, let's call, uh, check behind. We could have probably called there with 7-5. We hit trips uh, with the king. Uh, if he's got some trash, he's just going to let go straight away. Uh, so we can do a value bet on the river. We do it in this, in this. We do it quite big. So then if it raises us, we fold. But he's still likely to call with uh, slightly better hands anyway. And... Maybe call if he's with his worse hands. You might have pocket queens or something. You, you might want to not let go. I'm not going to call there. We've got a uh, flush draw coming through. It's pretty low though. I'm going to call one more. Two is a good card, I think. But I'm going to bet quite big there. We spiked our card on the river, so I think that hand was pretty good. Uh, King Queen just doesn't have any good cards there. Uh, top pair, we're not going anywhere there. Not anytime soon. Uh, I'm going to call there just because we can, we've got a lot of turn cards for us with the, that other hand. That wasn't one of them. Yeah, so just get out of the way. Check five. It's a pretty cheap bet. I'm just going to flood it. Just going to fight um, ace 10 as well. All 
Okay, seven seats is gone. Got a straight to get a bit that one. In turns gone. I'm gonna call fives one more time, just it's cheap enough. Top pair okay hand. Alright, we're just gonna call there with trip eights. Alright, fold with pocket fives. Just call him down. Got a lot of showdown value, so there's no point. We just call behind. He could have a nine. He also might not as well. All right, it's going to check behind with ace 10. Could have the winning hand. I got a heads up table. Jack, we're opening. Five three, got a club on the board. There's any reason why I'm calling. Yeah, calling again. We've got some backdoor flush draws happening, so who knows? Ace 10 sometimes to fold there now. About around the hand. Ah, damn. Let go. We missed it. Pocket Kings there, Ace 10 misses. Now we're looking. Right, sit down to 19, but I've had some good hands. Alright, so hit the straight, so we're going to bet that. Our hand's at risk, so we need to bet while well, we've got the best hand there. And it's a straight as well. Check nine's going. It's just not a nuttish type hand, the Jack-9. Jack-10, beautiful hands. Miss everything with Jack-10, that's fine. The board's so low, it doesn't matter. Top pair, okay, kicker with 10, King-10, which is fine. Ball in, we get out the way. Alright, gonna call one more. Probably could have three bad ace queen offsuit. I right, gotta let go King 10 there. Probably could have called Paul Sands for the other one. I got a fight ace jack suited, just expecting for someone to raise that hand. They always seem to raise. King Queen, we've got over cards. I don't think anyone's got anything substantial there. Let's gonna let go of ace jack. Yeah, nothing there. We hit three, but that was about it. So tight, I'm gonna fold. It wasn't much of a three bet raise, it was like four cents to call, which we'll call. Alright, we hit mid pair with King Jack suited. Good ace king, we hit top pair. Good spark a queen with ace 10. No chance there now, there's a couple of hands we're gonna let go. The ace could actually be good. I'm gonna call one more with a nine coming up, hopefully. It's only a small bet, so we're not really risking stuff. The nine's there, but wrong hand, like wrong table. Yeah, 10 has gone. Uh, 
Not suited, we'll play it 7-5. We'll open up pocket twos. Yeah, we'll open up pocket checks, it's fine. Check fold there in that spot, it's not good. Checks are coming in. Checks could be in trouble, so we just check there. Yeah, we'll call it that. Do that with a lot of um, troublesome cards. Could possibly check raise with the, with the ace. He's just gonna let go there. It's it's tough. He could have ace queen there already. There's full houses, so chasing for a king there is not gonna be the answer. Like chasing for the straight is just not gonna get the job done. I don't think. Yeah, hit second pair, but it's not great. Second pair could actually be better now that the kings are paired up, though. Okay, um, we just check behind. We'll check call the river. There's nothing hurting us there. Two's gone. Probably could have called before, the other hand. Nah, he's showing weakness, so we're going to bet that the ace. Alright, we're going to bet there. Chances of a four is pretty slim. Especially from under the gun. Unless he's got public fours, but. That's gonna fight their queen jack just for extra four cents. He top pair, okay kicker. Ah, uh, um, if he throws a good bet on the river, I'll probably folding queen jack because the king come out. Yeah, we're going to fold there. I think we're bad there a lot of the times. Ace nine is gone. Nah, it's going to call behind with ace queen. He could have a jack. We just don't want to put off the hand, just win the small pot. Two's gone. We're gonna call pocket fires. We're not gonna raise. What well, fires will just flat there and just hopefully um, hit a five on the flop. Yeah, it gives us a free card. We could actually be really good here. I'm going to actually bet this one up quite big. He might fold there a lot of the times. Because he might be worried about the ace, uh, the pocket jacks, which protect us. So we can we can bet there and he'll fold a lot of uh, overcards that we're worried about. That he's trying to, you know, draw on us on. 7 6 is nice now. We've got two hearts on the board. Missed everything, I'm gonna bet it anyway. Right, pocket twos. King eight suitors going in. Ah, two cents, I gotta call ten nine off suit. Trust me, it's not a great hand, I know. I gotta bet it. I'm gonna bet troop eights. I gotta bet the flush, there'd be folds. It's cheap enough, you can throw these bluffs in. Some of them might actually just fold because they're not showing any strength. Yeah, 
Alright, getting rid of some of these hands, it's fine. I call two cents, there's two other players in the pot. Probably twos are joined in. Get a four with ace four. Two's a missed. Call one more time, see what happens. Two's holding on to do life. Let's go for ace four suited. Queen's coming up. That's a shame. I think I might have been in front there until the river. Two mate suited. I'm going to throw a bet in there, just to see what happens. Not a great hand. 10-8. I've got an open ender. Alright, I've got a bet there because I've got a flush draw as well as an open ender. And a pair as well. I'm just check it on the river and we could still have the best hand. He could have a lot of... Yeah, we just call that. It's a weak bet. It's against Mrs. Percy. Could have probably bet there. Ace King whiffs again. Ace King's folding. Just gonna call their pocket sixes. I'm going to call more, one more for pocket sixes. It's cheap enough. Uh, could be well behind here, but could be in front. It's going to go in, go to the river. Going to throw a bet in there with trips and see what he does there. Showed no uh, strength at all there, but he could do some weak calling on the river, hopefully. Ace two offsuits, just no good. Uh, and a three that need a lot of help. All right, the checks are in. Call one more. There's a lot of there's a lot of um, back draws. Same thing again in nine eight, but the difference is we hit a card. See if we can get a queen and get a rip. Trip sevens there. Jack Nong is just bluffing. Slowly down a little bit now. And Jack Suda with folding. We probably could argue the point of calling. Sixes could be really good there. Missed it with 9-7. We could probably bet there if we wanted to. Don't get in the habit of just betting everything that we've missed. Well, they could be folding. I got a fold king eight suited. It is a gut shot. Sixes could be good there. A king's hand suit is going in. Jack nine suit is going in. His queen is going in. Ah, king 10, we're in position. We're going to bet it. His queen's throwing a seabed in. His four is throwing a seabed in. I'm going to call one. Bit of seabedding didn't work. Yeah, unfortunately, I'm not going to win some hands there. I think we just lost some. Fives aren't going to get there, unfortunately. Right, it's a nice flop for Ace Queen. I'm 
Gotta half bet the ace queen. Hopefully, he check trades us. Let's get a shove. Do an over bet on the river and see if he calls or not. Three bad ace track offsuit. It's not a great hand. Good got a ten there, but gonna let go. Go three back queens. Ten eight suited gonna go in. Going to check raise the queens. I right, got a three bet ace king. Is maybe you fold on the flop with a set of queens. Top set's always nice. I gotta check there, but it's still a good hand. Board pairs up. Alright, I gotta. Go for value bet on the river. Raises us and we don't have to fold top set. This queen misses. Go for steal. Not going anywhere at second pair there. Queen three is gone. King queen's gone. Jacks are continuing. I'm gonna fold there, he seems pretty tight. Yeah, I gotta bet Queen Jack there just because he's there was a few draws there that are cool. Could check the hinds. Yeah, we had a better hand there. Nice. These little pots actually just. They just catch up and just add a lot of value. So I think we overall we're still doing pretty well. Queen 10, we have to call there. Got a lot of back draws. All right, so we'll get Pocket tens. Open up with Ace Queen offsuit. Yeah. 
I could open up Ace Jacks. A6 suited. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm going to go 5 and L very soon. It's because we're playing so much better now. Uh, we're actually. I think we're going to win alright today as well with this. This Jack is just going to let go. Jack would need. A gut shot. I'm gonna call with ball three. It's crazy, but a lot of good things can happen. A lot of bad things can happen as well. Right, so four three, just gonna let go. Hit trips. Gonna raise it. We have got trips with the top kicker. Still after a jack. Just didn't get there, but four threes is no luck. King Queen, which is folding. Uh, I'm gonna call a four. I right, just gonna check behind there with Ace Five. Probably could have called. Oh, I got the two pair, I gotta value it. Ah, right, two pair, I got a bet. I gotta check there just the fact that we've got a flush. Call four sands. Alright, I'm gonna call there, just, I'm gonna bet there just in case you get a sticky under pair. Pocket twos, one more. It's because he's deep stacked. I got two pair, gonna bet it. Pocket twos, letting go. Alright, few, few folds, check tens going in. Yeah, get raised, we just get out of the way. It's as easy as that. It's not upsetting because we had a decent hand and a lot of bad hands will actually call them. Fours are coming in. Yeah, Fours is just trying to get to the river. Couple of light openings with 10 super 10s. You're gonna call one more if we hit a four, we're loving it. Same again with twos, seven cents, you just can't really say no. 10 8, we've got a straight, we've got to raise it quite considerable. Yeah, 10 8, we're just going all the way in. Got King Queen there, just collected. He's got aces, I think it was. Alright, got a bet there because it's a flush draw, and he's gonna. Alright, so it's a nice hand. Hit bottom pair. He's gonna fight there, King 7 suited. I right, hit two pair, we're gonna bet there. Cool one more, we get an eight, we're loving it, but we didn't hit. We've only got bottom pair there, so can be check folding a lot of the times. Maybe the two pair they folded to. Ace Queen offsuit, we're gonna bet into. King two is gonna flat. We try and steal with ace suit uh, ace offsuit hand. Uh, he goes to three bets, steal us, and that's fine. And sometimes you think, oh no, they they're actually targeting you, but most times they're not. They just actually got aces or kings in that spot. We're gonna go for value there. 
Up to any hand we'll worry about is King Jack though. So we have a lot of good hands there chasing like maybe Ace Jack or something here. Just checking there. Top pair, top kicker, we're getting value in. I'm gonna call it Ace 8. We could probably check raise there. Probably no point. Ace 8's gone. King 10's coming in. Ace Queen's going in. Couple of light openings. Open endo, we're just gonna bet into. Gonna fight there, ace queen, but sixes are calling. And ten's gone. Just gonna check there behind. Just trying to get a small pot. I'm gonna raise him with a set. King ten's gone. Get to the river with second pair. Should be good. All right, flush draw. We missed this one. That's a shame. That was a big one. Could have actually really scored big, but we got this one instead, so hopefully it's not a cool one. Yep, so trapped in with the kings. Alright, we got him pretty good. Well done everyone. Um, Jack 10, let's go. Goes all in, we're not calling that. Alright, pocket twos are just folding. He's playing with his chips. I'd say when they play with their chips like that, it could mean two things. Like some people might do it with marginal hands just trying to play. Another thing too is they could be trying to entice you and they're bored of their aces and kings not getting paid and they're really happy with their hand. But I guess it's really play to it's play dependent. Let me know in the comments what you guys reckon. Did you do you guys actually think that um they're gonna have like what do they do when they do those sh uh, card tricks and other chip tricks are they gonna be weak or strong all right it's gonna fight there with king queen Let's go fight there with King 8 suited. Got second pair, we're not going anywhere. Happy to play some small little cheap pots. Still a, well, we'll get third pair there, so we gotta let that go. Okay, we've got a bit there. There's a lot of nasty rivers. We could already be beaten as well, so anything like a raise, we're gonna fold to. Check the river. Probably check call the river, maybe. We'll just have to find out what we're going to do there when it happens. Eights are just going to check. Probably check call. Try and spike an eight. Just trying to spike an eight. That's what we're doing. Uh, hit a six. Ace King will bet. Alright, pocket eight is gone. We did like third pair with the other one. Uh, pocket jacks, we're gonna call at least once. Let's see what he does with pocket jacks. I can let go of jacks there. Our bases around the corner, unless they folded. No, aces are still there, it's still good at hand, I think. Probably check raise the queen jack and just turn it into a bluff. Uh, 
Ah, I'm going to turn that into a bluff. The queen hand. Same thing again. I think one of them actually worked and the other one didn't. Yeah, one of them, one of the raises that worked, the other one didn't. So just cancelled each other out. I'm gonna fold there. Getting the queen there is pretty slim. All right, seven six is getting uh. It's a few draws going on. Eight seven suit. I'm probably gonna let go. Just want to get it to the river. Right, I'm gonna raise it quite big there because we've got the flush, and a lot of nasty cards will come on the river as well. Yeah, ace king we missed. Just move on to the next hand. That's fine. All right, just let go. If he just calls and then we check call, we just check check the river, that's fine as well. But I think we could easily be scared of those hands there, but I don't know. If we can get a king on the river. No luck with ace queen. Are we getting the river with ace check? It's gonna get out of the way, that's fine. Opens there. Uh -uh. Okay, call the session. Thanks for watching, guys. Cutting it early. Oh, that was pretty quick. All of them are done. All right, let's see what the damage is. Also, remember, guys, um, the question was, when people use the the chip trick, you know, the chip emote, to act like what they're going on, what are they doing? Like, is it good or bad? Just let me know in the comments. Um, actually, we weren't up. I actually thought we were up this session, but it didn't, come, it didn't go up, actually. Still sitting at 47, so lost um just lost the blind so that's not too bad not great but it's not that bad it's still saying we're at 2600 so it hasn't actually changed yet i'm hoping it's above 3000 next time we see it because we've only got 10 days to go and we've done five days so far but gotta remember we're doing a lot more sessions at the moment but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoying the series. Trying, I reckon. I thought we did a lot better that session, but obviously, must have fallen short a couple times there. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys, and good luck, whatever you guys are doing. See ya.